Welcome back. This next power couple is changing the dynamic and perspective of marriage. Lev Love's mission is to replace generations of damaging patterns with hope and love. So joining us now is Jermaine Leverett and Geraldine Leverett. They are the power couple that we're talking about. They're the founders of Lev Love. And I was talking to you guys that uh, you're studying to become a family and marriage therapist. Yes. Uh, and I am a big advocate for therapy. But before we talk about that, that's sort of like the, the long-term goal of Love Love. What is Love Love? What do you guys do? So Love Love is a marriage ministry that is designed to, equip, designed to equip couples with tools so they can have healthy, long-lasting relationships. And uh, I am very interested in uh, human pathology and patterns and humans love patterns. Mm -hmm. As, even if those patterns are bad, what we will try to do is we will try to recreate those patterns in our adult lives. And so you, got, unless you get in the way of that. So, it, you know, you mentioned trying to replace generations of patterns that are bad. How do you do that with your group? And so we start with helping them identify where they're stuck. Right. And we help them see where that pattern could come from. Right. And we help them to understand that it makes sense yes. to them where they are. Okay. And so for that to make sense to them, we have to show them and now we have to give them a way of how to get how to get unstuck from that. Right, and so you have to sort of work on rewiring yes. and, and changing direction. So how do you do that? What are the services that you guys provide? So we have coaching program that we do. We have premarital counseling. We put on date nights for our community as well as we are speakers. So we travel and we do speaking engagements, um, just empowering couples really to help them to understand that they can actually have a thriving marriage. And I feel like you don't hear that a lot anymore. Yeah. So we're trying to change the narrative because at the core of every home should be a healthy relationship mm -hmm. which will create healthy communities which will help healthy kids to thrive and that's how we will impact generations to come yes I think especially in uh, the United States we think about change on this huge level mm -hmm. you know I got to change the country I got to change yes. my state <laughs> but to really only you should just Let's Go focus home on your change. home first, yes. and that'll yeah. make huge Im impactful changes. Yes. How did you guys start this? How did you guys start Love Love? Why did you start it? Yes. <laughs> so um, when I was in school, I was also working with kids during, with a mentoring program, and I was just praying like, Lord, what do we do with our marriage? Um, it's year three. We've always been taught we do more together than we did, than we did separately. And so uh, he reminded me of the kids and how the kids are only a product, product of what they were brought into. Mm -hmm. And so seeing that, and then the Lord reminded me of like when I was in high school, I was always the third wheel and I was always the matchmaker. I was always the one to bring them back together. And so with that and with the kids came the idea of, okay, you need to help the parents. So you yeah. need to get in therapy. You need to learn it. That way you can start to change some of those intergenerational patterns. What do, do, have you guys noticed patterns that, that you have been able to get in front of to make a healthier marriage? <laughs> Absolutely. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah. And I, I guess I'll just share mine. I think it's the bigger one. So I learned that I have unhealthy, I have an unhealthy relationship with finances. Uh -huh. And so having conversations with my wife about finances, it's a trigger for me. Yeah. It's a trigger from when I was with my parents. And so I don't want any parts of that. Like if we can't just be cool about money, like I don't want to talk about it. Yeah. But I learned that I have to engage into those conversations and assert myself for us to have a healthy relationship in that aspect. That, that's a great story because I'm sure that there are so many people out there who have relationships, they don't understand why they're not working, why, why they feel stuck or, or maybe, they're, maybe they're not and they just, they want to make sure they enter marriage with a good healthy mindset. Yeah. I think that's a, a great, uh, that's a great thing to share because unless you sit with those feelings and you actually acknowledge them, then you'll never move past them. Right. And so, you know, we have coaches in all kinds of things. You have your diet coach or your, or your, yep. your sports coach. And mm -hmm. so it would make sense that you have a relationship coach. Absolutely. And you don't see a lot of that, but we yeah. have the Thriving Together coaching program. And within that is our blueprint, how to thrive, built to thrive. And it's a six step system to help you to have the relationship you want so you I can live it. the life you deserve yeah I love and it. so when you think about it when you're when your car is stuck in the mud yeah and you're mashing the gas and you're only mm -hmm. going yeah. in circles you get frustrated because right. you're like i'm giving it gas like i'm giving it energy so i can get unstuck yeah but yet you just find yourself 
going over and Same over. Patterns. You're, you're yeah. frustrated. You're you're. It's just, it's a lot. You're repeating those patterns. All right, you guys have an event coming up real quickly before we go to, to break. When and where is the event? How can people uh, join? We have our next level couples retreat, September 22nd and 23rd. We have partnered with Seven Sycamores and Ivanhoe. Don't want to miss that. You can find it on our website at www.levelove.org.com. And then we are doing our Dancing Under the Stars line dancing edition October 14th. Okay, so don't super miss it. fun. All right, we'll have all the information yes. about the line dancing, about the retreat that's coming up. Thank you both so much yes. for being here. I love Thank the work you. that you're doing. We appreciate it. Uh, stay right there. We'll be right back.